If you've worked in Word or PowerPoint, then you're probably familiar with the thing called the Quick Access Toolbar. Well, here in Excel, we also have access to the Quick Access Toolbar, and it's there to give you quick access to different functions and features that you normally use in your workflow. It's very customizable, and as you can see, mine already has some customized items. I, of course, have the Save button right here. I have the Undo, the Redo, the Spelling and Grammar Check. I have the Save As, and I've got the Print Preview and Print. And these are not standard out of the box when you launch Excel for the first time. You can, of course, add and customize whatever you want here by clicking on this little drop down. And the more common features are going to be listed right here. But, 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 if you want to add more functionality to this, just scroll down to the more commands and click on this. A new dialog box window opens up. And from here, you can add all sorts of different things. Once again, it's gonna give you access to the popular commands. It's, this is Excel trying to figure out normally what people use, trying to give you the most common items to choose from. But if you even want more options, you can click this drop down and go to all commands. And what this will do is it will make available pretty much almost every single thing that you can do in Excel. And you can click over here and you click one of them. So for example, let's say, let me go back to the more common items, popular commands. And let's say that I wanna add the create chart button here. Instead of having to go look in Excel, I can add it to the quick access toolbar. I'll click create chart. I'll click add. You see it over here. Now it's not up here yet, but as soon as I click okay, it's going to appear in the quick access toolbar. I'm gonna click OK. And now you can see that the create chart button is now there. If I have something there that I don't want, I don't really need the create chart button there. I'm going to click the drop down again and I will go and see it's not here, but it is in the more commands. So I'm gonna click that and it's right here. I'm gonna click on this and I'm gonna click remove. So it's very customizable. Also, if you want to move the quick access toolbar for whatever reason, customize the quick access toolbar and you can do the show below the ribbon. This thing here is your ribbon. So I'm gonna click show below the ribbon and now your quick access toolbar has moved down there. Personally, this just, this just doesn't feel right to me. This just really, oh, this doesn't work for me. So I'm gonna put it back to where it belongs in my opinion, which is above the ribbon right here. So that is the quick access toolbar. For even more great tutorials and our complete catalog of online courses, please visit us at mrfordsclass.com.